wouldn't mind Bill O'Reilly if he wasn't so damn smug. He's a dickhead. He's just so he, smug and... He interrupts everyone. Yeah. And when he doesn't like what you have to say, he's just going to interrupt Cut, it, cut his mic. Well, you know, he, gets a, he used to invite, like, radicals on just to, like, belittle be him. And when the radical would be kind of, like, stand up for what he believes in, he'd just be like, cut his mic, he's crazy. Or just yeah, <laughs> cut him off and just, yeah. they like, go, we're going to uh, we'll go to a commercial or whatever. <laughs> so he had a pedal under his uh, desk where he'd just be like, bam, 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 cut, cut, shut cut. the fuck up. Yeah, that's not cool. So I, I, I used to watch his show more when I lived with my parents because they'd usually have, like, they'd go back and forth from conservative and liberal. They'd watch both sides. Of, my mom's kind of a political junkie and she's just like watching what everyone's saying. Yeah. And uh, they would usually have that on for at least a little bit. And sometimes his, the conversations were interesting on his show. Like, sometimes, but then he spins so much shit too and it's like you said, so smug and arrogant. Yeah. She's like, come on, dickhead. <laughs> like, you're already, like, what, 6'4", or something like this. You're rich. Like, can't you be nice to people? Yeah. Even just if you be disagree. nice. <laughs> you can well, just use his word. I watched his word recently. Oh, because he's defending himself. So people are coming after him after Brian Williams got taken down. They're like, oh, Bill Riley's been lying for, like, 20 years, and no one's came after him. <laughs> so Bill Riley got really, like, miffed by this. And he's like, I will take these people down. Do not come after me, blah, 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 blah. That's what he said come after me. Say that and see what happens. <laughs> Don't come after me and I'll show you. <laughs> okay. So he's doing his word where he talks to the audience. He just narrows some up and he just went, and now this is what happened and this is what they're trying to do and this is what the media does. And this is the magic, like he found this document magically. And this is a document that proves that I was here and there and did this and them. I'm just like, I don't believe you at all. And you treat people like morons. <laughs> yeah. It's hard to really respect someone when they have no compassion for other human beings. Yeah. Well, I shouldn't say that, because I'm sure he has compassion for other human beings. I'm sure he has a ton of compassion for other human beings. But on his show, it sometimes seems like he has no compassion for people that have a different opinion than he has. Mm -hmm. And you have to... You can agree to disagree sometimes, and... I don't know. Can you? I think you can <laughs> agree to disagree. 